West New York Commissioner Count Wiley is alleging that former town attorney Gilberto Garcia denied him the right to legal representation from the town back when employees from the Parks and Public Property Department were removed last year. Wiley voiced his concerns to new corporate counsel Donald Scarizzi at last week's special meeting. I explained to you that in the past there's been, when it comes to my office, I'm supposed to be protected at any time, right? That's anything that infiltrates my office or impedes in my office as the executive officer. And um, I'm supposed to be covered as far as if the attorneys are needed by the insurance itself. That's correct. Okay. And there was an incident, I guess I'm the Gil Garcia, where my office, the employees were being removed illegally, okay, when the Parks employees were all taken out, put in a DPW, and it was voted on by these commissioners that are here present, um, which I instilled to them to let them know that it was illegal what you were doing. Now, in regards to my office, at this time when that took place, I was denied services to have counsel. I even have emails that explain that when I asked Gil Garcia that if I can have counsel to return my employees back to my department. It went on for a year. I was denied any counsel. Okay, I was emailed it. It's not going to happen. You have to go retain your own services. So as in my office as a commissioner, I had to go in my pocket, go uh, hire counsel to go fight back in civil service, which he did plenty of services, many hours that I had him back and forth communicating with the civil service. And obviously, we you know, the civil service takes a little longer sometimes. It doesn't happen overnight. And it took me about a year. No matter how angry you are, no matter what I did with a recall or whatever I chose to do out of the passion for my heart for these people, that's what had to be done. And this retribution, I keep telling you, it, it, it doesn't belong in the town hall. You know, being angry at a commissioner, even it's political, if you want to take that, you take that to the street, but you don't take it out here inside the town hall. And I believe that's a lot of reasons where people in this, a lot of things in this town were done incorrectly. They weren't done, they weren't done properly, and, and we've got a lot of problems. You know, going back to my question is now, shouldn't I be properly be able to hand those bills into you to reimburse me for the five grand I had to spend to defend my own department in the town? Um, we'll look at it and, and talk about it. I mean, I, you know, it's, it's impossible to rewrite history, and, and I wish I could in a lot of ways. I'm sure we all do. We all have things we'd like to do differently if we <coughs> could do them differently. And uh, this all, history's all, documented, all, all, you know that, right? It's doc I, very well documented. I'm, I'm told that, um, yeah. you know, but but um, but uh, you know, the very first at the very first meeting you know, that we had together, um, the item on the agenda was to restore your people and to run the department, and you've been doing an excellent job doing that. So, um, what whatever um, you know, we'll look about you know past redress if you'd like to talk about that. Um, you know, and, and we're in this process now. Uh, we're actually, uh, you know, Commissioner Frias is working hard uh, right now in the budgeting process um, to get a budget um, uh, prepared uh, for introduction as soon as possible. So we'll, we'll look at this in the context of that as well. Garcia did not return calls seeking comment from Hudson County TV. I'm John Hytus, Hudson County TV, West New York.